Hey guys, welcome to my Coachella slash music festival makeup and hair tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to get this makeup look and also this amazing glitter roots hair that I have going on. It's super easy and I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. So let's get started. I've already prepped my skin with moisturizer. I'm going to go in with this Becca Cosmetics Backlight Priming Filter Primer and don't mind the ratchet way that I'm putting it on. I'm running out, so this is my only option. To prime my lids, I'm using Maybelline's Color Tattoo Crayon in the color Barely Beige. Next, I'm using a color from ColourPop's second phase of their monochromatic collection. This is the color Sauvage, and it's a pressed eyeshadow. I'm just applying that all over my lid with my Morphe M135 brush. Now going in with another ColourPop color. This one is from their first phase of the collection. This is the color Cutouts, and it's a really pretty peach. I'm just applying this to my crease with a MAC crease blending brush. More ColourPop love. This is the color Take a Break from the Nectar palette. And I'm applying this color to my brow bone and just blending it out. Going back in just to redefine that crease a little bit. Now I'm applying one of my favorites and this is not an ad. I'm using my Farsali Rose Gold Elixir and I'm also trying these NYX Cosmetics Total Drop Foundation Drops. I couldn't find my perfect shade, so I'm mixing Golden Honey and Mahogany. And I have to warn you guys, these foundations are really liquidy. They are really good and they are full coverage, but they are super liquidy and they have a lot of movement, as you will see. They moved my pants because I'm a klutz. <laughs> Blending it all out with this big foundation brush from Iconic London. For my concealer, I'm mixing my Farsali Rose Gold Elixir with the NC45 Studio Finish Concealer from MAC. Concealing a second time, per usual, with this Tarte Maracuja Priceless Concealer, and this is the color Tan Deep. To contour, I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit, and I'm mixing the colors Cinnamon and Chocolate. And of course, I'm adding my Farsali Rose Gold Elixir to that. And I'm telling you, this is not an ad. I just love it. Okay? To contour my nose, I'm only using Cinnamon because I feel like chocolate is a little bit too dark for my nose contour, but, you know, do as you wish. For my blush, I'm going to be mixing Max I'm a Lover and also this like shiny metallic pink color from ColourPop. This is the color Forget Me Not. To set my concealer, I'm using this Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm just going to apply that under my eyes and to any places where I get oily in my T-zone. I personally have never been to Coachella, but I hear it is hot as hell, so set that makeup curl because you do not want to be running and looking crazy, okay? To set my contour, I'm using NYX Cosmetics Hydra Touch Powder Foundation, and this is the color Nutmeg. 
since it's Coachella, you can go all out. I'm using two highlighters. First is Becca Cosmetics Shimmer and Skin Perfector, and this is the color Blushed Copper. Now I'm using this Too Faced Love Light Prismatic Highlighter, and this is the color You Light Up My Life, which totally sounds like some Chainsmokers Coachella song, doesn't it? <laughs> now for the fun part. I'm using Max Chromographic Pencil. This is the color Process Magenta, and I'm putting that pretty much all over my lower lash line. Now from that same line from MAC and just on the inner corners, I'm applying Primary Yellow. To set that pink, I'm using ColourPop's Poodle Eyeshadow. In the inner corners of my eyes, I'm going back in with Take a Break. Now moving on to brows. And if you want to see a regular speed video of how I do my brows, I have an all about brows tutorial, go check that out. But first I go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz and this is the color Ebony. Then to just give it a little bit more definition, I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Pomade, and this is also the color Ebony. To line my lids, I'm using MAC's Liquid Last Liner, and this is the color Point Black. For mascara, I'm using L'Oreal's Voluminous Feline Noir. And if you notice from some of my other videos, and if you follow me on Snap, then you know that I've been wearing lash extensions for a really long time, but I've decided to give those a break. Truthfully, nothing pulls a look together like a strip lash. So these are Lily Lashes, and these are NYC. I only use Duo Adhesive, so this is the Brush On Adhesive in the color Dark. Prepping my lips for a matte color with my First Ollie Rose Gold Elixir, and lining my lips with this ColourPop Lippy Pencil, and this is the color Birdie. For a fun splash of color, I'm using this lilac colored lipstick. This is Lazy Lullaby from MAC. And to give the lips a little bit of a shine, I'm using the ColourPop Sauvage eyeshadow and I'm just patting that onto my lips. Now moving on to the glitter roots. All you need is a small little plastic container, some hair gel, plenty of glitter, and whatever kind of glitter you can find, put all that in there, and a brush. Put enough hair gel in the container that will cover all of your roots, and just start sprinkling the glitter all up in there. I'm using NYX Cosmetics Glitter 6 and this Pink Hearts glitter that I found from Michaels, and just mixing it together with a paintbrush that I found in the dollar section of Michaels. Now you're going to apply it to your roots only, but you can also switch it up. I've seen a lot of people put this on like the corners of their edges and different things like that, but this is a glitter roots tutorial, so we're going to stick to the roots. To be totally honest and transparent, this is my first time actually attempting this, and I love the way that it turned out, and I'm literally obsessed. I want to do it all the time. If you are curious about how it washes out, honestly, I just used a little damp paper towel and it came right out and I washed my hair twice and there you go. It was gone. Now I'm going to apply these little iridescent rhinestones to the under parts of my eye, literally right underneath my pupil along my lash line. And that's it. If you are going to Coachella, have so much fun for me. I won't be there because Beyonce won't be there. No, I'm just kidding. I won't be there because I wasn't invited. But hopefully, maybe, you know, somebody might invite me within the next few days. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you for the next one. Bye.